Brett's, uh, Brett keeps it from being too quiet in here, gives us quite the beat to work with, and I'm very grateful he's here every week. How the hell is everybody? I've seen we've got a lot of new faces tonight. I just wanted to take a quick poll. Please shout if you're new here. That is a lot of you people who don't know what the hell you're doing to join us in us not knowing what the hell we're doing. Good. Awesome. So what you need to know is, you'll notice I'm down here for a moment, and we're using this extra space because we have a little surprise in store for you in a minute. But you're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. But the, you'll, you may have picked up on the... New lady got in on it. That's nice. <laughs> okay. There's no fourth wall. Much to, my, much to my chagrin, there's no fourth wall. Please join in the fun, join in the madness, and, and most of all, do not sit far in the back and be quiet. Otherwise, you are only getting a small sliver of this experience. You guys good with that? Yeah! Fantastic. I'm going to go up there and make it official. Yeah! Bum, 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 bum. I know, it changed, watch this. Whoa! Alaka Theater indeed. <laughs> Welcome all! Yay! That's a very mixed response. I don't know how to feel about it. We'll try again. Welcome all! Yay! It's not, it's not, it's close. It's, it's, it's close. It's, hold it. I have a plan. Okay, so I want this side of the room to scream. I probably should have pointed out like a more of a cheering, happy scream. That's my fault, I understand. More of a happy cheer. I want this side of the room, since they've been so vocal, to kind of give me the really good meh we're all feeling. It wasn't very loud, but it, it was very heartfelt. We'll try again. So first the cheer. And then. Now which side do you really want to be a part of? Do we want to be a part of? Would you guys like to join in on that? All right, here we go. One, two, three. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Theater is, by definition, the death of cynicism. There's the, you can't pause it. You can't stop it. We're here. We're in the room together. We might as well be excited about it. You guys get the idea? Yeah! Fantastic. That is what we need. And don't you start with me. Because I'm riding, I'm riding a big, a big wind. Because I had a moment that would blow even your cynical mind out of the water. You ready for this? Yes. You ready? Good. Brett's ready. Are you? Sure. Sure. That's what I live for. Is sure. Are you guys ready? <laughs> See, they're ready. You can be all okay. So I'll tell them. I'll, I'll include you. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're welcome. So. You're standing in this room, new people especially need to know this. You're standing in this really amazing, big, crazy room. What you have to understand is that this all started with a juggling club that didn't want to get caught in the rain. The weather of late has had this on my mind, of course. But we were, we were a juggling club and somebody said to us, you want to start a theater show? We said, that might mean we could juggle in the, when it's raining out. And we said, yes, knowing nothing about theater. That was the beginning of everything that has happened since. We started as a juggling club, we became first street performers, and then ultimately we got this theater opportunity, and then that spiraled into multiple theater opportunities, multiple shows, and everything you guys are excited about today. That happened. You're, thank you for that one person who jumped into care. The rest of them are kind of joiners, but I appreciate their energy too. So we have all of this stuff going on, it's super exciting. And last weekend we got to kind of return to our roots. We were invited by the city of Dallas to start performing on the Continental uh, Pedestrian Bridge. And so we went out there, we didn't go out there like one guy, let's see what happens. We brought an entire show. We brought costumes and characters and production values. And what did Dallas bring us for our reward? All of the rain. 
We got out there full force. The weather was gorgeous. Amazing. We announced that we were going to be performing. Everyone was like, oh, the circus is coming to town. It was so cool. Everyone was jazzed up. I'm riding around my little penny farthing bike. Everyone's all excited. People are being stupid. People are playing music. It all comes to a head. We come, we ask, are you ready for a show? And they say, yeah! And at that moment, the sky exploded. <laughs> there was a face painter there, and we crammed the 50 or so people that had come out to the bridge to hang out with us into this little tiny eight by eight tent. So we're sort of fighting to get gear inside and she's like, get in, get in, get in. And we all cram into this tent like sardines, as many of us as could fit. And we're all crammed in there and we're looking at each other like, well, what's it gonna be? And I finally, I ask, I say, do you guys wanna wait out the rain and do the show? And you gotta understand, there's a lot of kids. I don't know which way it's gonna go. And they're like, looking at themselves, realizing they're already soaking wet anyway. We're realizing we're already soaking wet. And they start saying, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, let's, let's go for it. And so we wait, and 10 minutes later, the deluge dies down. And so we, we step out and we go, let's come on, come on. And this little crowd of people come out from under the tent. We're all doing this, and we set up to do the show. We've had to move the show to a hill where the water is running that way because it is now a flood zone where we were going to be. And everybody moves over and we're like, okay, we need you to turn 90 degrees. And this entire gaggle of people turns 90 degrees. We're <laughs> super awesome. And we do the show. And we're on a hill now and we do the show. And we do the show. And as we start getting up to energy, the rain starts again. And I mean, it just, you feel the wind kick you up and the rain's starting to come down and everybody's got that look on their face like. <sighs> and one little kid down front says, keep going. And from the back, we heard an adult say, yeah, keep going. And we're soaking wet. It suddenly dawns on me. I'm already wet. Everyone's already wet. I say, are we going to keep going? Yeah. Yes. And so we all turn and we all look at the clouds and we all go like this. <laughs> this accomplishes nothing, but it makes us feel really good about ourselves. <laughs> we do the rest of the show. And, and it worked, and it was a ton of fun. Yes, it was a smaller audience because, well, we were in the middle of a hurricane. <laughs> but I come back here, and I'm so excited because, once again, I'm reminded about support from an audience. This was an audience willing to stand in a storm just to be with us, and it blew my mind. And I wanted to thank this room for something in particular. When I was crammed into that tent, it's one thing to come up here and, and perform and be theatrical. It's, yeah. it's quite another to, to go out and be crammed up against your audience and say, I don't know, what's it going to be? And be honest and be conversational. That is something I only learned here. And I wanted to come back and tell you that we succeeded because of something you guys taught me. And I wanted to say thank you and welcome back to the open stage.